my Ramadan goal and it's to read the Quran in 30 days and today I'm going to show you how I am going to do that first off what you will need is of course your Quran mine is the pink rainbow Quran what else you need is a sticky note and just a marker or something to write with okay so my tactic like I I made it up myself I'm gonna like write on every sticky note the day so I will know which day I have to read so I will I will write like up here day one and every Jossam has like 20 pages and I'm going to divide those in two the first 10 pages of the Jossam I want to read like before 6 p.m. kind of and the other 10 I will read like afterwards I have to read those after so I will give myself enough time and I'll just see when I will get the time to read it maybe on Sundays I will just read all Joseph in like an hour I don't know maybe I won't do that so I'm going to separate each Joseph from the 20 pages into two so I don't have enough time oh and another thing I think I'm going to set alarms for myself like when it's near those days I'm going to set an alarm so that I won't forget because like maybe I tend to like forget because like I'm busy doing other stuff so I think I'm going to set a few alarms and see if I will need them throughout Ramadan or not we're, we're gonna see we're gonna see guys and by the way it's getting hot again so that means Ramadan is go coming soon every Ramadan it gets super it, it's it's just super nice weather and I'm like why why now okay I'm going to start off by finding the first chosen that's not too hard okay, so I have the first 10 pages because these are sticky notes that are like this I am going to turn it upside down and write here the day so it will stick out like this like a bookmark I'm just gonna make bookmarks okay this one screwed up I'm gonna, I'm gonna write another one <laughs> wait I think it's better if I take a fine liner yeah that's what I'm gonna do be like this and I'm going to stick it okay so it will look like this it says day one and when I open it I will see that I have to read like the first 10 pages and I'm going to do that basically for every day I hope I really really hope that I can pull this off because like every every year I'm like okay I'm going to read the Quran this year and I'm gonna read all of it I have never accomplished that goal, so hopefully, inshallah, I will this year. Right here is part two. Wait, maybe I'm going to do part one and part two. That's, yeah, I'm going to do that. Okay, so this is how I am going to write it. Wow, there's going to be a lot of sticky notes. <laughs> an update I am writing every day on the sticky notes at first and then I am going to put them all in just like the other ones because that's just so much easier to do now right now I'm at day 9 part 2 so here we go I think I don't have enough notes I only have four left and I'm on day 15 it's my last note well guys Ramadan is going to be only 16 days <laughs> oh my god I gotta go search for more more notes I hope I got some
and some more right here. That was it. This is what I needed. It's not going to be pink, but whatever. God, look at all these notes. Wow. Oh my god. I think I've got to sit, sit back a bit. Wow. Oh, oh my god. I just ruined a few notes. Alright, carry on. Day 17, guys. This whole table is going to be full of sticky notes. Oh my god. Wait, which day was it? Oh, day 21. By the way, get ready to get those comments. Oh, you also can drink and stuff like that. Oh my god. I had enough of those kind of comments. I, I think we all did. I would love to know, like, at what age did you start it to fast? I, I actually can't remember my age, but I remember I always wanted to fast with my parents and they were always like, no, you're still too young and you can't do it and stuff like that. I think I was 13 or 14, I don't know, but when I started, Ramadan was like getting into the summer months and that means if you're in, like in Holland, we have to fast. 19 hours something like that I don't know but it's a very long time and you can only like eat for three or four hours and then you have to fast again something like that so when I started I had to I had to begin with fasting for a very long period of time and I wasn't used to it like when I was little I wasn't used to it and it was pretty hard for me but you know I managed to get through it oh wait I never made a part two for day 24. <laughs> Wait, uh oh, that's not what we want. Oh my god, I don't have any place left. What kind of snack do you like eat when you're done? Like, for me, it's just give me tea. Oh my god, like tea with I don't know something. It can be anything as long as it's food. And nine out of ten times, you go out and buy lots and lots and lots of food because like one tip don't go to a supermarket don't go there if you're fasting because you will buy the whole place out like oh my god whenever i go to the store with my mom or my dad or just with my parents to go and get some food i always tend to get all the stuff that i normally don't eat you know those basic day foods like peanut butter oh my god i i start to crave peanut butter in the middle of ramadan like i'm wait what and then i go out and buy it but when i can eat it i won't because i'm already too full and then my mom's always like i told you not to buy it <laughs> let's see when i'm gonna choose this time because last year it was peanut butter and what do you guys do when you're up all night i'm always watching tv or watching a movie so good love those nights i'm always like if i stay up i'm like way too energized when all the others wake up to eat again oh my god i'm just way too energized and everyone is like oh my god Sajana, shut up and sit down and eat and go away because they are all so sleepy <laughs> they're still so sleepy oh it's so funny okay update look at all those sticky notes Oh my god, it goes all the way up there. <gasps> okay, I got all these sticky notes. Now we're going to go put them in here. Okay, so what I'm doing is I'm going to put my first sticky note at the place where you can see where it's like a six. Right there. there that's where I'm going to put day six. And from there on, I'm going to count till ten. The page right here. This is what I'm not going to read. I'm going to stop here and I'm going to put my note again right here so I will know that I have to stop because that's where part two is going to start. So let's put this one right here. No way, I just discovered that I miss number 27. Oh my God. Oh, it's right here. 
it's right here. Oh my god, it was it was stuck on my hijab. Oh my. Oh my god, drama. Oh my god, I'm done. I did it. Oh my god, look how it looks right now. Wait. Oh my god, that was fast. I thought it would take up much more time and it's pretty easy to do so I would definitely recommend to do this right now you can see day one it's all ready to go for day one and each day I have read it I'm going to, I'm going to put out the sticky note I feel so organized <laughs> well I hope that this will this will help me to read this Quran in 30 days let's see I'm gonna keep you updated and let me know if you're also going to do this. This was the video guys and I hope you learned something from it. <laughs> let me know if you already like did this and what your experience was with doing the putting like the sticky notes or if you have another method that can also be. Comment stuff down below about Ramadan. I would love to read it, read about it. This was my video. Thanks a lot for watching and I hope this will help you. I will see you in my next video. Don't come believe it. <laughs> oh my god. The sticky notes. I don't have any sticky notes left anymore. Oh my god. Okay, bye 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 bye.